Welcome to the video. In the next series after the current Pixhawk one that we're doing, we're going to be doing yet another flight controller. This one though is a little bit special. For those of you that have been watching my channel for a while, you'll have probably come across the Nase 32 series. And with the Nase 32, we spent an awful lot of time looking at something called Clean Flight. Now, Clean Flight is written by a gentleman called Dominic, and Dominic has been very, very kind and actually sent me his brand new flight controller that he has actually had a big part in developing. So whereas on that NASA 32 series, we were constantly battling some of the limitations of the NASA 32 hardware, this new board has all of the advantages and none of the drawbacks. So this, in fact, is a seriously pro racing board. So if I take it out of the packet, there it is. So this has quite a number of advantages over the Nase 32 and CC3D. It's a full board. There are two versions available, one without the uh, magnetometer and barometer. This one has both, so we can do things like add GPS to it, a part of the series. It has a faster CPU than things like the Nase 32, one-shot ESC support, uh, very tiny. It's only about, I think, 36 millimeters side-by-side, -side. stackable as well if you really wanted to do that. It will support things like battery monitoring, it has uh, sonar, buzzer support, all kinds of stuff. But the really cool part is, is whereas with the Nase 32, we were constantly running into problems where we ran out of places to plug things in. So for example, if you wanted a buzzer with a sonar, with the LED, with the PWM, it, you started to have to use things like soft serial. This has an awful lot more input output ports and UARTs on it so we can plug everything in at once without having to worry about it. So the reason for this video is two things really. One, to thank Dominic publicly for sending me this to support uh, both myself and all of you, my subscribers, who are interested in it. Uh, this is quite tricky to get hold of right now. Um, so I'm very honoured that Dominic put one aside to get in my hands so that we could start a video series. But what I'd like to ask from you, my subscribers, just like we've done on many of the other board series, is what is it that you would like to see? So please, in the comments below, take a little bit of time. Just let me know what you're interested in seeing with this board. And then I'll try and incorporate as much as I possibly can into the upcoming series. Hopefully starting that uh, within the next week to 10 days. And by the time the boards come back into stock, we'll have the first videos up so that people getting them can start to configure them and follow along with the series. Thank you for taking the time to watch that video. There are lots of other videos on the channel and they're carefully ordered into playlists. So you may find that there are other videos on this same subject that you can go and watch. So I would recommend going into the playlist area of Painless360 YouTube channel and looking around and seeing what there is. You never know what you might find. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and happy flying.